when you come into the quilting screen and you see your um your first stone it'll be up in the top left corner the very first thing i recommend that you do is go into zone manager before you do anything else and here you want to make sure that everything is like it needs to be okay if you have a rolling rail frame you want that width at a hundred percent and then the height, you want it for your machine. I have a 21, so I have it set for 95%. That means QCT can count on 15.97 inches that it can quilt in. And then as far as 100, that 15.96, that is my safe area width, which must be greater than the total width of the panto. And then you want to choose your placement, whether you want center placement or four point. Do you want every zone to start on the left or do you want it to alternate from um, the left to the right as you adventure quilt? And then do you want all the stitches to start on the left, which is uniform, back and forth, which means it will sew across and then do a jump stitch down and then go back? Or if you choose continuous, it will stitch across and give you a straight line stitch down and then back across. So these are the things that you need to make sure are like you want them before you get started. Then you say, okay, and then um, do your settings and do your optimize. If you were to place your zone and do your optimize before tapping on zone manager, you would lose what you did and have to redo them. So I hope this has explained zone manager.